The remainings of the factory constitute a complicated set which is difficult to decipher due to the numerous changes made in time. Beside the square section chimney, there are three main buildings where the great steps of production took place. Grinding the canes, treating the extracted juice by cooking until crystallization, collecting the black trickle in the sewer. The brick-lined ground basin situated in the eastern part of the factory allowed to supply the steam mills with water. The basins that were not deep, situated in the south, delimited by low walls, enabled the water produced by the generator to cool. The whole set of the buildings display rubble and stone masonry. Brick is used to surround bays or the portions likely to fire. The masonry is generally coated with lime mortar and sometimes whitewashed with basaltic sand. The material is generally reused. The cut stones are mixed with pebble walls, heat-resistant bricks or even mechanical pieces used for filling up. 